CBS, the bold and the beautiful spoilers revealed that although Grace was warned, Carter many times he will not pay attention to Grace this time. Exactly. Grace forbade Carter to approach Paris or develop a romantic relationship with her. Carter and Paris were forced to break up and, of course, before that, Carter was the one who took the initiative to leave Paris. Paris is very resentful and does not want to accept an ending like this. She thinks that Grace has interfered too much in her love life, so she will defy everything to hold on to Carter. Carter was at first determined to end with Paris, but the situation didn't seem to be going well. Paris will certainly use all means to get Carter back. Carter fears Paris will disturb Quinn's marriage out of jealousy. Maybe that's why Carter returned to Paris. She was surprised and delighted when Carter made such a decision. Only one person is standing still about this. Grace had no choice but to go to Ridge and say that Carter was the one who always harassed Paris. It seems that the secrets Eric is trying to hide won't be able to keep any longer. Although he is still married to Quinn, he is secretly dating Donna. Every Wednesday afternoon, he lied to Quinn and went to the handball club, but actually went to Donna's. The two of them had sweet and hot moments when they were together. Eric felt himself brimming with enthusiasm around Donna. This he couldn't find while living with Quinn. Perhaps since the day Quinn betrayed him and slept with Carter, he also created a psychological obstacle to her. How long will Donna and Eric plan to continue this relationship? Does Eric plan to confess his deception to Quinn? It seems that he won't be able to hide it much longer because someone has found out that Donna and Eric are in love. But we have yet to receive information about who this person is. Surely this mysterious person was also shocked to see Eric having an affair with Donna. Perhaps the person who discovered this will be no stranger to us. He knew Eric's identity, so he had such a surprised attitude. In the end, Eric being careful before and after was no longer meaningful. He and Donna didn't realize they were being watched. And of course, the secret was revealed. Will Eric get it all sorted out before his followers expose it? Besides, is he planning to choose Donna or Quinn as his woman? Finn died by shielding Steffi from Sheila's bullet. Of course, his passing is a great regret for his loved ones. Although Taylor is grateful that Steffi is alive, she still feels pity for Finn's harsh fate. In addition, Taylor is also at fault, and it is difficult to face Lee when Finn encounters such a bad ending. Taylor also doesn't know that Lee has saved Finn's life and is hiding him in a secret place. For the time being, Lee will not reveal the secret to anyone, especially the Forrester family. After all, Finn had such a tragic ending because of his involvement in that family. Lee temporarily did not want to talk about Finn's problem anymore because Steffi was equally grieved after witnessing Finn's passing. Taylor is not to blame for this either. It's just that Sheila's grudges against others have made Sheila a mad human being and harmed Finn. Just because Finn and Steffi were married, Sheila came forward to admit her relationship with Finn. Why does Finn always have bad luck when he comes into contact with the Forrester family? But anyway, that was Lee's opinion, but she knew that saying it would only make things more complicated.